All right, so part two of Electric Gremlins, I've gone ahead and just gotten a uh, rectifier right here. See if it's going to work out. This one is actually an eBay model. We'll see how it actually how it actually works. I mean, it, it worked in the bolt-on position. The only thing that you need to know is that you've got to get longer actual screws because if you look on this side, you can see the difference right there of how that thickness is and how that is versus getting into the bracket. So that's about it. But other than that, we'll see how everything works. All right, the new rectifier is now in. Let's go ahead and test out the voltage to see how it looks. That's not so great. At idle, it's only showing 12.2. Put on headlights, it's dropping down even more. So. Is the rectifier working or not? Let's see when we rev it up. When we rev it up, it's still dropping voltage. So perhaps it is not the rectifier. This needs a little bit more testing to find out what's actually going on with this actual bike. Uh-oh, it died. <clears throat> so I better get home because the stator has just died. Ugh. <laughs> Battery just died. That's no good. Well guys, there you go. My bike just died a couple blocks away from my house after I changed that stator out. So yeah, that seems like to not have worked at all. So now I'm actually kind of stranded over here at 7-Eleven. So, <sighs> go ahead and figure out what I'm gonna do maybe I can jump start push start this thing I don't know we'll figure it out from here and try to get my way home good thing is that I'm not too far away from home so until then I'll talk to you guys later peace 24 hours later so guys here was a problem right here the actual positive terminal coming off of this guy um, was on the wrong side for whatever reason it was on this side the right side and really when you look at the corresponding pieces right here for the male and female plug like you need it to be on <laughs> this side so what I did was I just took a flathead screwdriver shoved it into the flat side of the top right here and pulled out the back and then it came right back out and I just switched the sides so let's go ahead and plug this in and hopefully it'll work I mean last time I was basically just running with no stator just running off the battery in itself so now that we got these terminals on the right side right there let's see if we get a start so let's go ahead start it up now we're hopefully being the 13s maybe in the 14s if we're lucky All right, so right there you can see the battery going at 13.6, 13.7, and it's climbing. Let's see what happens as we rev it. It drops a little bit, but stays kind of steady. I would like to see it spike at 14, but it's staying there. 
and it goes right back up to 13.9 so almost 14 see what happens when we hit the headlight on drops down a little bit keep revving it I think it's about the same so if you guys have any ideas what's going on just go ahead and let me know right now it seems to be oh I don't know like dropping and then going back up and dropping and going back up and I know the uh, the rectifier is good so maybe the stator is next battery seems good to me too so um, you know maybe the stator is next but we're gonna ride around see what happens with this guy if anything else I'll report back to you guys as soon as I can so talk to you guys later peace